Greetings from Solve Gadgets. Are you ready to view the assortment of cool gadgets we compiled today? No wonder Robotic Spider could soon be inspecting sewage pipes. You will be amazed by observing mobile robotic systems to perform various tasks on construction sites and manufacturing facilities. Get ready and let's move on to the video. The ultimate benchmark regarding building and construction robotics. This robot's developer states on their website, the team has five years of experience and five international awards, so these are not simply hollow statements. The robot is capable of a lot of different things like mill, grind, lay bricks, use a formwork and plasma cutter and 3D print concrete. Since each robot is adaptable, it's easy to set up data interchange and operate the job, even from a smartphone, thanks to the open platform. The most sophisticated model's arm stretches 10.2 feet and is accurate to within 0.04 inches. Moreover, the group welcomes cooperation. Do not hesitate to contact them via the website. The following invention is so awesome that it was featured on the cover of the legendary Time magazine, not only due to its aesthetic appeal, but additionally for being considered one of the greatest innovations of year 2022. Then what does it perform? An intelligent prosthetic hand, called the Asper hand, weighs roughly 0.8 pounds. It includes 288 distinctive parts consisting of silicon-based materials as well as plastic. The neurocomputer interface connection is the key driving component. A hand is three times more comfortable to manipulate and uses machine learning to progressively learn as a result of the sensors measuring both brain impulses and muscle activation. Consequently, it will really improve the owner's quality of life. This is likely the reason the project garnered investments totaling roughly $3 million. This appears to be unremarkable. Suddenly, in another drone aircraft that was flying about crashes into the water. Does the drone appear to be damaged? Stay positive. This drone is aquatic and feels equally at ease in the water as it does in the air. Unexpectedly, a group of eight Swiss students are engaged in this assignment. The design version has a 1 kilowatt motor that would be 4 feet long and can reach a maximum speed of 31 miles per hour. In experiments, the drone was able to dive to a depth of 16.4 feet and swim at a speed of 6.8 miles per hour when submerged. Nevertheless, there are obstacles to overcome. While submerged, the charge will last for 8 minutes, but only 4 minutes when in the air. But still, this invention could serve as an inspiration for other teams worldwide. These robots are therefore attempting to make utility and road employees' lives simpler over time. This little white one has the ability to check pipes, seal joints, and fix leak problems. Moreover, the large yellow ones sweep the streets, drill holes, cut wood, and carry out additional duties. If you'd want, the robots are even willing to let you use a lightsaber sword, regardless of the fact that it's unclear whether it backs the Jedi or the Sith characters. The system also incorporates machine learning and AIM technologies for data collecting. AIM's implementation provides the client with an interactive map and an infrastructure database. The technology can be used on smartphones as well, and it makes it easier to adapt your working time by showing you right away where you require backup. The following is the Time Magazine's pick for the top innovation of year 2007. Using a flying wing-like body structure known as the blended wing, the Boeing X-48 is an experimental prototype drone developed in the United States. As compared to the Airbus A380-700, engineers estimate that a 480-seat passenger variant might be roughly 32% more fuel efficient. Generally speaking, there is a problem. The Boeing X-48 is quite challenging to fly. There have been various other versions that are widely recognized. The X-48B, for instance, has a cruising speed of 124 miles per hour and a 21 feet wingspan. In year 2016, Boeing updated their website with the most recent information on the project. The organization stated that it will be collaborating with NASA and anticipates the development of a comparable aircraft as a subsonic mode of transportation for both military and commercial purposes over the next 10 years. Moreover, there seems to be good news for those who still favor commercial airliners. 
present day a technology that enables an aircraft's engines to be switched off while being towed. This will lead to significant cost reductions. Taxiing uses approximately 5% or thousands of gallons per day of the overall fuel that airplanes consume. After landing, the dolly will go through the tunnel towards the nose gear where it will take up the struts and pull the plane to the preferred destination on its own. Everything would run on electricity, therefore a network of tunnels 47.2 inches wide and 31 and a half inches deep is necessary. Even under challenging weather circumstances, the intelligent system will govern the towing routes and keep from making mistakes. On top of that, the emissions are going to be less dangerous. You might recognize a Japanese robot spider for sewage maintenance on your screen. Because of the reality that this work is hazardous and difficult, there is a high unemployment rate. The robots will presumably need to maintain the approximately 304,472 miles of sewage pipelines in Japan. The robots are able to work independently or in teams of three. This means allowing for immediate improvements to be made. The 360-degree view is provided by the camera. The interface's control is simple and reminds one of a video game. Its dimensions are 28.3 by 9.8 by 11 inches, and its weight is around 7.7 .7 pounds. Upgrades like adding a robot arm are possible with the Versatile platform. A fun fact that the market for R and VR devices was estimated to be worth roughly $29.5 billion at the end of year 2021. The recon business, which has demonstrated that these goggles are powerful enough to compete with a personal computer, took portions of it. The small casing houses a 1 GHz dual-core CPU, 1 GB of RAM, 8 GB of internal memory, and a battery that could also run for up to 5 hours. In accordance with the description, the tiny LCD panel with 428 by 240 pixels feels like a 30 inches monitor. The goggles function in all weather and are designed to be used while wearing gloves, so of course they support GPS, Wi-Fi, and Bluetooth. It's noteworthy to note that Intel eventually purchased Recon, although the public did not like the change. Those who ordered the goggles will still receive them even though the project was abandoned. This is a straightforward and easy-to-use utility. The sifting shovel will be useful for gardeners, utility workers, and baseball field maintenance personnel. As baseball has been played in more than 120 nations, the concept is not only intriguing, but also has the potential to be quite lucrative. $109 is the price of this item. It has a core made of fiberglass and is a one-piece construction. The shuttle weighs 4 pounds, with handles that are 27 inches long and a bucket that is 5.5 by 6.7 inches. The area will be cleaner and safer once the garbage, rocks, and other objects have been removed. However, it does raise an issue. Wouldn't it be cost-effective to buy a standard shovel and drill holes in it?